Local, live, late breaking. This is KMAX News at 10. But working with Hockley County and making sure that we provide justice is vitally important. So county officials signing off on a move to bring a capital murder trial to Lubbock for a man accused of killing an officer. Hi everybody, I'm Brian Mudd. And I'm Lauren Motter. County commissioners unanimously approved that interlocal agreement with Hockley County for the change of venue for the capital murder trial of Omar Soto Shavira. He's accused of killing Sergeant Joshua Bartlett. KMAX Cameron Mendoza joins us now with more details. Yeah, Brian and Lauren, three years later, plans have been set for the trial of Omar Soto Chavira, which will take place here in Lubbock. Lubbock County already agreed to moving the trial here. This morning, they had to sort out an agreement on costs of the trial and who's paying. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Are there any opposed? Motion carries unanimous. Thank you. This is sort of a Lubbock County trial as well, and so we take a lot of uh, ownership in this as well. County commissioners and Judge Curtis Parrish in agreement not only to bring the capital murder trial for Omar Soto Chavira to Lubbock. The change of venue on uh, the shooting death of uh, Sergeant <clears throat> Bartlett. But they worked out other details with an interlocal agreement, including any expenses brought in from the trial and how they will be paid for. We will charge the expenses of this trial back to Hockley County. Now, Hockley County has received a, a fairly sizable grant uh, from the Texas Attorney General's office to also pay for this. Chavira was arrested after a SWAT standoff that lasted 10 hours in Leveland in July of 2021. Chavira was charged with capital murder of a peace officer and aggravated assault against a public servant. After being accused of killing Sergeant Joshua Bartlett, injuring Sergeant Sean Wilson and three others during the standoff. His trial was originally set to be held in Cleburne, but the change of venue request was agreed to by both sides in the case. While the trial was moved, Hawkeye County will still prosecute the trial, which is set to begin in September. It's really all three of us working together, Lubbock County, Hockley County, and the Attorney General's Office to make sure that justice is served. And if convicted, Chavira faces life in prison or the death penalty. Currently, he is at the Hockley County Jail on bonds totaling $1 million. That trial is set to start on September 16th.